Taurus, I feel like somebody here is, is really hurt here, okay? Um, I feel like you gave the key to your heart to somebody who possibly felt like there was a soulmate situation here, only to end up so in love and by yourself at the same time. I feel like for some of you guys, you guys are getting tired of crying. There's like almost like no more tears left here. Um, there definitely was some type of uh, upheaval here. There was some type of disaster when it came down to this union. Um, some type of chaos, some type of shocking event. Um, sudden change, destruction, negativity um, has ensued, um, which is, I don't know if it was because you guys threw hands or because there was words exchanged. Nonetheless, intimidation, deception, conflict, hostility, pride, defeat is here. I feel like this damn sure was um, a connection that um, was a marriage, possibly somebody who, like I said, soulmate, somebody who somebody thought could have something with, okay? Um, possibly baby mom, baby dad. All right. But I do feel like possibly you're thinking about this or they are, this person could be a Scorpio. This person could be a Virgo. Um, as of right now, that's all I have you guys. So let's go ahead and let me glean some information here because I do feel like uh, in your energy it's saying so in love but it's also saying no more tears okay it's almost like i've already put all the energy that i can it's like i don't really have any more um energy to put into it um there's too much intimidation here there's too much change here too much conflict and chaos and deception and upheaval negativity and hostility it's, it's becoming overwhelming for somebody that uh somebody definitely did give the key uh to their heart to holy spirit can you please tell me about this energy here Thank you. Right. This is somebody who um, Aries is also here. This is somebody here who is very much so um, somebody is very attracted to this person. I feel like somebody is very angry at this person. I feel like possibly you or them wants to give an apology because honestly, um, this has went like way beyond where, where it needed to go. OK, you guys, um, the, the, the arguments, the heatedness, you know, all that is just a little bit too much here. Give me um, right because of the illusions and delusions and confusion that they cast it on somebody here. So in love. Somebody is so in love. They're suffering at this particular time. That could be you, Taurus. That needs to be uh, nurtured. Some compassion here. Um, no more tears. Somebody's cried a river behind this. I wouldn't be surprised if I see the five of a cups in the when we do the tarot, because somebody dang sure did cry a river. But no more tears though, nonetheless. Um, right, action, go mode. Yeah, see, somebody's mad. They ready to get active, y'all. Listen, this is hostility, y'all. You know, it really just is. It's, it's, it's hostility. It's intimidation. It's conflict. Okay. Um, and like I said, somebody's ready to get active. They, they're they free and they don't want to be free. Somebody walked away from somebody here. Okay. Um, this feels like you, Taurus. Um, unless you're dealing with another earth sign. Give me more on this intimidation. Yeah, this does not feel good at all right here. Right. Somebody is damn mad. They're pissed. Okay. They're angry. They're ready to get active here <clears throat> because they gave the key to their heart to somebody here that hurt them a lot. Somebody changed up. Somebody flipped mode on somebody here and this shit hurt. Um, somebody's lonely. Somebody's thinking the toxic patterns, the toxicity hurt. Um, yeah. And somebody is just can't stop thinking about this person. Somebody cannot stop thinking about this energy here. Tell me about the soulmates and this loneliness, Holy Spirit. Yeah, see, it's riddled with disharmony, triggers, and conflict, y'all. Somebody is definitely not on the same page. You got the tower out here. Somebody hit the tower head first. Something blew up in somebody's face. It's just what had happened, you know. Lacking doubts surrounding this energy. This person is very tempting and deceptive. Lots of emotions here. And now there's limitations here and fears, okay? So fears too. Because like I said, somebody is very upset. For some of you guys, it's going to be very, very angry. Somebody's damn sure doing a lot of projecting here. Um, tell me about this soul searching and introspection. Man, this is too many emotions. Okay, this is too many heated emotions going on. Cancer Pisces Scorpio may have something to do with this, but there's too many emotions. I wouldn't be surprised if I see King of, Queen of Swords upside down too. Somebody's damn sure um, trying to find some in, introspection here, some wisdom. Okay, some inner guidance. Somebody needs some guidance here. Yeah, because they can't see. Okay, with clarity upside down. They just don't. They can't. They, they're soul searching. They're self-reflecting, but they still can't see. Ten of Cups. Somebody was supposed to get back together. This was supposed to, this union was supposed to represent security, harmony. A peaceful life for some of you guys. 
possibly um definitely happiness uh possibly marriage but uh yeah somebody is watching spying watching and inspecting here somebody wanted to get this back on Taurus I feel like it's you I feel like you wanted to get this back together here okay um but there's a lot of control here there's a lot of control tactics that's going on within this union that um let me see yeah, but see, it doesn't matter because the chemistry and the passion. Somebody's definitely overlooking something. Um, somebody is scared of this sur releasing, surrendering, and purging. Somebody damn sure. Um, this person might decide to drop the mask, y'all, possibly. But this person needs healing, you guys. This person is closed off, guarded, and resistant because they need some serious ass healing. You may hear from this person. It's a possibility, okay? Um, but yeah, I do feel like there's a lot of illusions and delusions that's being casted on somebody here. I do feel like somebody definitely does want to get active. I feel like there has been some type of anger, intimidation, hostility, somebody threw hands, something happened to that degree. Somebody definitely does want an apology. Somebody is very in love here. Um, they definitely want some nurturing and compassion from this individual um right now they're feeling lack they're feeling suffering okay um no more tears that's because somebody's ready to get active they're free i feel like somebody is free and they don't want to be free here um so yeah there's arguments here i feel like you know the only thing that somebody does have control over is the arguing okay the the, the maybe calling and not being on the same page or whatever the case may be um, when, when you talk to this individual, or when you're around this individual, vice versa, puzzle pieces. OK, um, but nonetheless, um, I do feel like somebody definitely did not want to change. I, I feel like courage had to take place. Somebody might be by the train tracks. I see a black dress. Um, yeah, somebody may live by the train tracks and luggage. Somebody might have moved, moved out. OK, um, but nonetheless, somebody did give the key to somebody's heart to somebody that it was very toxic um, bondage and patterns. They're thinking about this person. I feel like it's you, Taurus. I feel like you're thinking about how this person hurt you. OK, I do feel like you think that this person was your soulmate or this person could possibly be your soulmate. Um, but at the same time, there's a lot of disharmony triggers and conflict here regarding this here soulmate, which has caused a bout of loneliness for some of you guys. OK, um, there's definitely limitations and fears here. This person, I love you too. This person is deceptive and tempting and a lot of them emotions going on here um and somebody is definitely in lack and doubt right now when it comes down to this projection somebody not being accountable for this tower here um that got hit okay love blew up in somebody's face and you know when love blew up somebody just cannot see they just not able to see clearly here but they are felt full of emotions okay that could be you that could be them that could be both okay um, but there is a lot of passion. There's a lot of chemistry here. There's a lot of love here, period. Okay. Somebody definitely did want um, to be with this person, Taurus. This person is either spying on you or you're spying on them, one or the other. Okay. Um, I have not, uh, I didn't get my, my cards out. That's okay though. But uh, let's go ahead into the tarot. Much love, much respect, Taurus. Thank you so much for still being here with me. You guys, this is your bonus video. I did not pull my... Um, my uh, letters and my uh, time frames, but we will do that at the end of the video. You guys remember for every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read. And also, um, you guys, shout out to my VIP, shout out Train to Go, shout out to my day ones. I love you guys dearly. And um, you guys, let's go ahead and get to this to this uh, read here, okay? Um, let's pray over these clarifiers in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Towards us, we're asking for truth, revelation, confirmation, guidance, consolation, peace, and protection as I give Jesus Christ, Yeshua, Messiah, all the praise, the honor, and the glory, okay? So this is what we're expecting in this read, all right? So yeah, there is a situation here to where somebody damn sure does love somebody, um, Maybe somebody's trying to stop some conflict um, that is going on. What is this card, Holy Spirit? What, what is this card meaning? Somebody definitely wants to mend this relationship, okay? That could be you. That could be them. They're, like I said, somebody can't stop thinking about this, okay? What about so in love? There's, there's a lot of love here, you guys. It's a lot of love and it's a lot of hang anger. Somebody damn sure did find out something, though. Um, there was gossip. Somebody lied on somebody. For some of you, that will be true. Um, somebody is damn um, damn sure immature. We got a third, third, third party situation here, you guys. We got somebody who's out here cheating and putting somebody over somebody. Somebody is going through some severe heartbreak. Give me more about this three of uh, swords. Definitely going through severe heartbreak here. No communication, no traction. No, if it's if it's communication, then there's no traction in communication. Okay, we're not we're not getting anywhere when we're talking. Okay, the only thing that's happening is round and round, and more fights and arguments, intimidation, threats. That's the only thing that's going on. Okay, um, give me more about this. Um, thank you. 
Right. Somebody wants peace after the storm, Taurus. Somebody damn sure thinks that they have um, mental clarity to do this. There may be some travel relocation, but somebody is definitely going to be talking about wanting some type of relief or peace. All right. I feel like this is you showing up as single, definitely on a paper chase, definitely trying to get your money up, your material security up. This may be you that's damn mad. Give me more. Your sons and your daughters, please. Thank you. Right. There you go. See you taking care of home. So you taking care of the kids for those of you that have kids. But I see somebody sad too, looking at what they did have and also thinking about somebody that was in their energy that is showing up to be a liar, stealer, killer, cheater, thief, fake, phony. Okay. Somebody lied. Somebody put on and this damn short, um, you know, fuck with somebody's happiness here. Somebody is not happy. This is, this is a diminished, um, um, this is dampen joy. Sorry, you guys dampen joy. Somebody is not happy at all here. Right. Somebody might have lost a child to abortion or a miscarriage. Possibly for some of you guys. Um, give me a little bit more on this energy. Leo is here. Virgo Taurus Capricorn is here. Gemini is here. Right. Definitely miscarriage or abortion. Okay. Um, so somebody has a key to somebody's heart. Okay. Somebody hurt somebody here. Unexpected events, unexpected challenges has happened. All right. This shit is out the blue with the tower in the will of fortune upside down. Let's me know that this is out the blue. So something unexpected. Okay. Leo, um, Aquarius, Scorpio on Taurus is here. Give me, give me this. What is this unexpected? Somebody found out somebody was married. Somebody's been praying a lot. Give me more. I feel like you're putting up boundaries or they threw up boundaries. Either you did or they did puzzle pieces. Take what resonate, leave what don't. Okay. Vice versa. Uh, give me soulmates. Thank you. Definitely ten of cups. Possibly married. Oh, this was supposed to be a reuniting. Y'all just got back together not too long ago. Y'all just re, re re reunited not too long ago. Possibly. Okay. Definitely pregnancy is here. Or pregnancy was here. Give me more. Somebody risked this. They risked it. They jumped out here. They did stupid stuff, fearless beginnings, and they risked this union. Give me more. Holy Spirit for your sons and your daughters. <sighs> said it was about some money. Possibly said it was about some stability. Somebody jumped out here on a money situation, or they made it seem like it was about some money. Yeah, but really, to be honest with you, they spent the money. They spent money. You guys, this person is very roguish. This per person is fearless. And toxicity. There's loneliness here. Some, like I said, somebody's younger than here. Younger here. It's a younger air sign, younger um, fire sign, perhaps, or just young-minded air and fire sign. Yeah. See, because what they did was they effectively betrayed somebody here when there was supposed to be overwhelming love. Okay, overflowing love that became overwhelming. Right. They effectively put somebody in a nine of swords. Somebody has a lot of mental anguish. They can't stop thinking about this. And uh, this has hurt them very, very bad. With the Ten of Swords, that's betrayal. That's left for dead, y'all, okay? Um, 19, 10, yeah. That, this is double betrayal, okay? So for some of you guys, this person's going to be messing with a family member or a friend um, or a co-worker. Tell me about the loneliness. Yeah, see, no more. Home ain't so happy no more, okay? Um, career commitments, home, family, and or commitments is not doing very well. That card wanted to come out. This one, right? Possibly divorce. Karma may be here for somebody. Sagittarius may be involved. All right, Holy Spirit, tell me about this tower. Other than somebody being left for dead. Yeah, there was never a start with this hangman. There was never a start. Something happened before it even began. Something happened before it even got on the ground good, okay? There was lost misfortune, adversity. Virgo was here. Virgo towards Capricorn. A lot of Taurus here. Somebody was blindsided. Definitely. Somebody was blindsided. Somebody was healing. For some of you guys, you guys were healing before you were blindsided again with these scandals and adversity and disgrace. Yeah, this person damn sure did have many options, okay? Even though they said that they loved you, okay? Vice versa, okay? Um, but they did, they, they sure did. Okay. Seven, nine. Yeah. This should have been something that would have lasted. 
I do see a reunion. This is going to be for you guys that have, um, you know, is trying to make up with the person or tried to make up with the person. Give me more about this tower. Virgo is here. Virgo towards Capricorn is here. Somebody's damn sure not thinking here with the Hermit in reverse. Somebody is go mode. Somebody's damn near Knight of Swords. Um, they're impulsive. They're seizing moments. When it comes down to this chaos, this sudden change, this unexpected event, this love blowing up in somebody's face. They're moving forward. They're not thinking. They're moving forward. Somebody is definitely not thinking here. Give me more. They want this love, this discombobulated love. That's you or them. Okay, you guys. Cancer Pisces Scorpio is here. They want to win. They want victory. Somebody possibly may be in the spotlight. Okay, achievements, awards, recognition. Um, Give me the Hermit Holy Spirit. You know, somebody's damn mad. Leo Sagittarius Aries is here. They're they're boiling over, you guys. They're, they're not listening to anybody or themselves. They're creating a lot of burdens and stress around this energy. They are very burdened and stressed and also creating because they're lies. Okay, you guys, there's a lot of lies here. There's a lot of hidden information, a lot of misconception, you know. Give me more. And it might be some witchcraft too, you guys, some spell work going on here. All right, that's going to be true for some of you guys with this queen of um this queen of wands, all right, and this moon. Somebody's a little bit older. What's going on? Taurus, I see you here. You're withstanding adversity. Jail hospital is here. Somebody's not feeling well. Give me the ten of cups. Yeah, somebody wants this back. So, I mean, the reunion that it will be the reunion, I guess that's what it, it is. I mean, after you guys get over all this anger, because there's a lot of anger. I feel like somebody definitely is throwing hands. Somebody got into a serious argument. This is intimidation. This is bullying. This is hostility, okay? Um, with the Ten of Swords, this is somebody being left for dead. Somebody is dang sure thinking about this a lot. But somebody loves somebody here, okay? This is somebody's husband, wife, somebody. Um, for some of you guys, um, this is a soulmate. You possibly was going to be your husband or wife. Definitely baby mom, baby dad. Like I said, I see abortion here. I see um, miscarriage here. Um, there is going to be some communication, you guys. I do feel like there's going to be an apology. I do feel like there's going to be some type of moving into karma waters, all right? Because this person right here, you guys, for a lot of you guys, they're on drugs. You guys are not thinking correctly at all, okay? Um, so with that being said, you know, possibly, you know, you got a situation to where there's jail here. You got another situation to where there's AANA, some type of sex addiction possibly, but they need to get some type of help. Holy Spirit, what else? Um, if you guys are still here with me, please go ahead and drop a earth sign, a earth sign, y'all, the world, okay, and emojis, and an emoji. That right there is going to let me know two things. One, that you're still here with me. One, that you're engaging in the channel, in the videos, and also um, that you are interested in getting a free read. Because remember, for every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read, okay? Yeah, see, you guys tower after tower, okay? So they get missing. They go off to this extra individual here. You know what I'm saying? They're indecisive. You know what I'm saying? They're indecisive. They're going off to this individual. You guys are hitting towers after towers. Somebody damn sure thinks that the grass is greener on the other side. They are weighing their options, okay, you guys? And this is the reason why this union is, is full of argu arguments, fights, and carrying on, okay? Because they constantly are going over here into, uh, you know, they got shiny object syndrome, see? And then you got death underneath. But, you know, hey, this... This is a necessary ending, you guys, but you know, it's a resisted ending. All right. With death like this, this is a resisted ending. Okay. So it's like it's a necessary, but resisted ending. All right. This is a lot of fights and carrying on. Okay. So let me um, go ahead and give you guys some months. Usually I have this done, but lately sometimes I'll be forgetting y'all. So, um, cross watcher energy can and will get involved cross watcher. I want you guys to know that I love cross watcher. Just like I love Taurus. If this is a Taurus that's done this to you, please go in the comment section below. Let me know. Um, because I am very interested to know how energy interchanges and you will be helping me out an awful lot. Okay. So with that being said, let me go ahead. Now these are not together, you guys. So, I mean, I'm, I may have a double. Okay. September, May, June, July, one through 15 is what I'm seeing. One through 15. August and April, okay? So April, August, July, June, May, and September, okay? 1 through 15 is the numbers that I'm seeing. February is underneath the deck. Um, if you guys are going through any type of uh, heartbreak, having a hard time letting love go, any of those things, you guys, please um, check my uh, website out. 
And that will be hrhnikkitarot.com. hrhnikkitarot.com. There I have read, I'm just, you guys, I wrote several articles there, you guys. I do need to update it. Um, but I haven't uh, did any any more on that website uh, for quite a while. I will be getting uh, to you guys, okay, as far as like writing another article. Um, putting more information out there, more tools out there, um, inf informational tools out there as far as like different resources in case you're in certain different uh, situations like domestic violence and, you know, that type of stuff. OK, um, but yeah, go check it out, though. Also, uh, if you guys are going on a spiritual journey, you find yourself on a spiritual journey, you're wondering about the neglect, you're wondering about the rejection, you're wondering about, you know, having to get away from your family. Why is family turning on you? That type of stuff. Um, please check my book out. It is called Train to Ascend. It is by me, you guys. Um, and it is HRH Nikki Nicole T. Phoenix, P H E O N I X, P H E O N I X. And you can find that on Amazon. And you can also, uh, with Kindle ebook, okay? Um, if you guys are interested in my decks, I have a few decks available. My situation decks, I have a high priest and a high priestess deck. That uh, deck is a situation deck. It is called um, The Naked Truth, okay? The Naked Truth. Um, I also have another deck. It's called um, Sip With Nikki on Sip Situations. Sip With Nikki on Situations. You guys are interested in that. That Naked Truth deck does have 130 cards in it as well. Just contact my email, you guys. I haven't got my store up. I will be getting my store up pretty soon, okay? And for those of you that are interested in addition to of uh, Aperio Illuminations, that deck will be done uh, probably by uh, the end of November, you guys, okay? So with that being said, we have letter E. Two letter E's. Two letter T's. J, M, Q, I, G, C, O, M L N. All right. Two letter T's. Letter N. Letter E. Two E's. J M Q I G C O M L. All right. So let me tell you guys who's here and then we will close out. All right. If I mention it several times, it just means that it's heavy. Okay. Um, but yeah, somebody definitely is going off, you guys. This is the problem. They're going off. They're going back and forth, possibly to a baby mom, baby dad, possibly. Okay, Scorpio is here. Uh, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Aries, Taurus, Cancer, Le Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Sagittarius, Gemini. Court case for some of you guys. Somebody got in trouble messing with this person. Definitely money. Money chasing. Illegal money. Something to do with that. Family, home, and or commitment has been destroyed here with this individual. Um, Taurus is here. Aquarius, Leo, Taurus, and Scorpio. Leo. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Yeah, arguments, constant arguments, but expect communication nonetheless, but it is arguments, okay? So um, with that being said, you guys, um, hopefully I was able to put that one piece together for you. If I was, that means I've definitely done my job. You guys, I love you guys dearly. Thank you so much for still being here with me, and I will see you guys soon. Much love.